Hey guys, it's Woody Mark here, coming with a brand new episode of Squad Talk Run Rotation. Wrong intro. Where. Okay, this is another episode of Road to Glory, Road to 100 Goals, where we're trying to get Victor Avarbo to 100 goals. I thought I was going to do the wrong intro there, and I was actually correct. But here we come up against a pretty good 4 4 2 side. But we dominate. Oh no, we're using a 4 on 2 on 2, so I guess it's pretty even in midfield. But Victor Barbo did have an injury in the last episode, which I'm pretty sure I'm going to upload this tonight. So that means that the last episode five days ago, Victor Barbo got an injury. So we're having to play Vuknich and Lewis Muriel up front instead for this episode only. So getting to. 100 goals is gonna skip an episode so it's just a road to glory episode but as you can see the music is starting which means a skill goal is inbound even though this skill goal definitely wasn't the greatest and it could be heavily improved it was still a pretty nice skill ball skill ball skill goal can't talk today but muriel with the berber spin and he's just too quick too fast shoots into the right side of the net to make it two goals to nil and I really can't talk today I don't know what I'm on about on that that is two goals to zero and we're looking like we are in good control of this game but Lichtensteiner v Evra Evra doesn't have that pace therefore Lichtensteiner wins and this is a penalty because when he tackles him he Gets my player. I don't personally think that was a penalty. I wish I showed the replay. But Vukanic, I thought, you know what? Bang it down the middle. It wasn't the stellarest of penalties. But it was a goal nevertheless. Which made it three goals to zero again. And it looks like we're going to win this game. But 54th minute into the 64th minute. Where I do a last minute rush with my keeper. Thinking I can get there. I hardly make that mistake if you've seen all of my videos that's actually the only that's the first ever goal I have conceded where I've rushed the keeper out in a corner because I rarely rush the keeper out so mistake by me but I think there was a little bit of deflection with that goal but the comeback is on because Hernandez gets the ball a nice piece of dribbling there and he shoots, and that was a pretty dope finish, to be honest. I thought I had him well under control. I would never have thought he would have shot there and scored, especially near post, but great finish. Fair play to him. But the gameplay was continuing, which means, no, that can't mean we concede another goal. It can't. We give the ball away. Eto is on the ball. Ashley Young going down that wing, but I successfully tackle him. And I decide to clear it out because there's no there weren't many options available for me to pass to. But here, nice um pass clearance, I guess. But I just keep running. He thinks I'm gonna make the pass, but instead I run. Sometimes the most basic things work. I cross it in Vukanic with a lovely header to make it 4-2. And I was just getting the sweat off my face, thinking, Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> because it can go horrifically wrong for you if you concede two late goals and you're 3-0 up. Like, really, two, nil should, two goals should be your comfort zone. But for me, it isn't. Because if anyone knows me, anyone seen me play any sport or even watch my videos, you know I love to choke. And... Yeah, choking is a lot of fun because it means <clears throat> it doesn't matter how many times you're winning by, you'll still lose. But Honda with the finish to make it five goals to two. Now you're kind of thinking, no, okay, that has to be it. He can't choke here. Well, you're right. I'm not that bad. Come on. <laughs> I Don't worry. He doesn't come back to score um, three more goals. That, that would just be horrific. But... I've done worse things, but as you can see, changing the team round, I changed um, Guadalajara or something like that in the CDM role, rotating the fitness. 
I believe Muriel has fitness under 90, which is actually the first time in a while I've had to play someone with that low fitness because I don't have a fourth striker because I play Victor Abarbo every single game, you see. So there was no need to get another striker, I guess. But I might have to transfer over some fitness cards, actually, because I'm running out for a Ibarbo, but Ben Arthur on the ball, he does a nice chop and a lovely cross to be fair. The build up on that goal, I believe there were two lucky deflections, but you know what? I could have tackled him when he done that chop. I sprinted and didn't hold L2 and stood my ground. Brilliant cross by him, had a goal, one goal to nil. And now we are into the 60th minute where he's held that lead. But don't worry, Lewis Muriel is on the ball, Zinger, who... I currently love in this team. He's an absolute beast or god. And then he rushes his keeper up for no reason. And I'm like, I will take that. And that makes it one goal. And it's currently looking pretty good. Really happy with Edison so far. He's He doesn't do... He's, he's just a solid cent attack, central attacking midfielder. Yeah, I can't talk today. Just because he isn't exactly the greatest passer, the greatest dribbler. But he's got that four-star skills. He's not bad. And he just gets some goals. But look at this skill. And I juke him. And I just finesse it under the keeper. Like you should do if the keeper's really close to you. You either really finesse it really low. Or you chip it over him. You either do one or the two. I would advise like rolling it on the ground. And then... That makes it two goals to one and you will score. But here, really big through ball. I actually fail a skill move there. I chip it because I'm worried that the defender's going to get there and block it. I didn't mean to get it that far to the crossbar, but I guess it happens. But I believe, if I'm correct, that it's the last goal. So if you have enjoyed the video, hit the like button, say why in comments below. And do subscribe if you want to see more. It's been Wyndham Wildfire here. See you guys. And we win the title. Woo!